uh, here's what I do in Back on the dope route, more money to spend Watch how I show out, never get it those out That'll bring the hoes out, dollar signs brung in That's what I know about, neck wish froze out Top five I no doubt, talk about what you got now Old money don't count, back when you kick out Quit one in your mouth, something flammable My hunger is unexplainable uh, Cool people, can evil in my alter ego Zero, tolerance be strapped wherever we go Sanchez 23, this is my newest pickup. Um, today is January 16th, 2011, Sunday. Um, I'm here with you for my newest shoe that I just picked up. Uh, this is an early release. These do not release till January 22nd, 2011. Um, and let's get into it. Let's show you what I got. First of all, here's my receipt. And you can see the date that these were purchased on. January 14th, 2011, um, and that's the price with the tax, okay, so that's what it is, and um, yeah, I mean, I don't pay $300, $400 just to have a shoe early, two months early, it's not really worth it, especially for general releases, I heard about people paying $300 for general releases, it's crazy, anyway, there's your box, Size tag, ten and a half. Elephant print all around in the paper. I will say this box is pretty flimsy. Um, I'm not going to be stacking these on top of each other. It's not a good idea. Um, here's the Jordan card that comes with it. It's pretty nice. All, all around the details are definitely nice. Still doesn't make the shoe one, worth $150. Um, so I don't have an original pair of these to compare. So what I brought out with these, the Fire Reds. And I guess those are from 2006, 2007 probably. And there you go. White cement, threes. Um, don't really want to review them, like all the details. But just quality wise, they feel pretty good. They feel nice and soft. Um, the leather looks really nice. So this is why I brought this shoe out so you can see the difference. Um, on this shoe, you can see the tumbled leather on the tongue. On the Fire Reds, the leather is not tumbled leather. There is tumbled leather here, which again is much stiffer, but better quality. You can see the wrinkles versus this one. You can see the wrinkles, but you can feel the difference on the leather. Um, yes, the tumbled leather is there. You have the perforated holes here. This looks really clean on the back, the white. For now, eventually, this is what it's going to look like, unless they've changed that. Um, and you can see my Fire Reds are doing a lot of cracking on the midsole, because they are about three four years old. You can see the cracking right there. Um, where these, of course, don't have that yet, which eventually they might. So, that's the shoe. 2011 White Cements. Um, yeah, they come out next week. Uh, they'll be general release to every store. I'm sure you'll be able to get a pair. It's not that big of a deal. Um, I still want another pair of these. These would love to have a pair of these. Uh, these always go good. I love the Fire Reds, so it's a nice shoe. Um, so that's the comparison real quick these are both ten and a half but for some reason these the white cements look much longer I don't know what it is these are both definitely ten and a halfs um, I haven't tried these on yet on the feet to see what they feel like I'm sure they're fine comfortability um, but this is a good shoe I know they're going to release the black ones and that's everyone's favorite but these are cool to have too these probably won't be worn as much from now until like maybe April, May, or June. That's when I'll probably start wearing them um, because they are all white and right now it's the winter time. So that's about it guys. Go check out the shoes. You'll be able to get them in your local store. The box price is $150. Um, if anybody would like to check out a really good video um, about a guy who's talking about some of these famous sneakerheads that are buying shoes for $400, $200, $300, $400, $500, $600, $700, $800, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000
two months just to have them for everybody else because they have money. Um, I know a lot of you young guys out there watching the video. So you, you got money, you got a job, you're able to get one, two pairs um, on the release date. But these guys are buying shoes two months early, three months early just to show off and you know because they have a little bit of money maybe more than myself or you guys so um, there's a guy named Lyricist Fan I'll put his uh, title right here you can go check out his videos um, he's ranting and raving about these guys and I guess he has more information than myself or you do and uh, he talks about you know why they buy shoes for $400 general releases like to buy this shoe for $250 $300 to have it two months early it's definitely not worth it I mean, if you got money, yeah, go ahead and blow it, but why not just wait? Because they came out a week or two early. If you go look at other videos, everyone's got them already. They've already hit stores. The little mom and pops, uh, Foot Locker, and everybody else will have them on the release date. So go check out the, that guy's video. He's pretty cool. Also check out www.deftronic.com. I'll put another link over here for that. And um, it's a pretty good website, really good quality. Guy shows sneakers. If you're looking for like a blog that you want to see sneakers, girls, information, videos, funny videos, he's got all that up there. Um, so go check that out. And that's it, guys. Uh, next preview, I'll probably be coming up with some uh, Zoom Kobe 6s, which the Concord release, I think, is one of the better colorways. I saw them yesterday in my hands, and um, I didn't buy them. I might get them next week. So look out for that. Thanks a lot, guys. Peace.